Unfortunately, this time lapse video showing the flash flood waters at a creek in San Bernardino County. Hillary is expected to bring catastrophic flooding to large areas of the southwest. And as CBS 2's Michael Spencer tells us, some California communities are now under evacuation orders. There seems to be no good place for the water to go in the Southern California desert. Torrential rain, swamping roads, and trapping cars. We've had storms before, but never anything quite this windy and rainy at the same time. Palm Springs is under a state of emergency, with Hillary dropping half of the city's annual rainfall in just six hours. In the higher elevations of San Bernardino County, rain sent trees and mud rushing down canyons. Residents in several mountain and foothill communities are under evacuation orders. Juan Pfeiffer and his mother left their home as floodwaters crept higher. It sucks to see it go, but lives can't be replaced. Material objects can. Near the coast, swollen rivers in Los Angeles are running full and fast. In Santa Clarita, the side of a road collapsed. And near San Diego, giant boulders crashed onto an interstate. Adding insult to injury, a 5.1 magnitude earthquake hit Southern California Sunday afternoon. Hillary is expected to keep pounding Southern California throughout the day, prompting Los Angeles and San Diego school districts to cancel classes. Stay safe, stay informed, and stay home. Nevada's governor issued a state of emergency, calling up the National Guard. And in Yuma, Arizona, 60 mile an hour winds knocked down trees and power lines leaving parts of the city without electricity. Michael Spencer, CBS News, San Clemente, California. And Hillary came ashore as a tropical storm yesterday afternoon on Mexico's Baja California Peninsula. At least one person there was killed in the floodwaters. Over the weekend,